French intensive care wards are filling up once more. France's fight against the coronavirus is as desperate as it has ever been, and its doctors are living familiar nightmares. This surgeon in Amiens describes how in his unit a mother and son have died of Covid at the same time. Their infection was, he says, the direct result of a family get-together. It's unbearable for us, he says, and a very difficult situation to manage. The French president rejected scientific advice to lock down earlier this year. Shops and schools stayed open and movement was restricted in only the hardest hit areas. Mr Macron had hoped to limit the damage to the French economy, but a new surge in the number of cases has forced him to rethink. Mes chers compatriotes de métropole, de l'outre-mer et de l'étranger. With the new variant, the epidemic is accelerating, he told his fellow citizens tonight, and there is a risk of losing control. Du variant qui risque de nous faire perdre contrôle. And so schools are to be closed once more and lockdown measures extended across a country where the vaccination program has been very slow to get going. I am frustrated to not have more doses because our coverage is still very low. And uh, I mean, uh, as a physician, I know that it's important to, to achieve a, a minimum <laughs> coverage in the population to be, to be really effective. Vive la République et vive la France. Lockdown was delayed to give the country a few precious weeks of freedom, the president said tonight. But at what cost? France is about to find out. Geraint Vincent, News at 10.